What's going on, guys? JT Bethers here uh, with, well, another episode of House Flippers, but it's also a huge, huge thank you to you guys. And I mean a huge thank you. I have done it. I have finally hit the halfway mark to a thousand. I've hit 500 subscribers. It's an amazing feeling. It took God knows how long. And uh, I couldn't do it without you guys. So again, a huge, huge thank you to you guys. I, I appreciate it. And they say we got some new houses. I don't want bunkers. You know, let's let's back at it. <coughs> But anyways, again, thank you guys so much for 500. You guys are simply amazing. Um, I do plan on still doing the contest. I, I got to figure some things out. I'll be doing five winners of a $10 game. $10, you know, is the maximum. Any game you choose, I don't care what it is. Um, but there'll be five winners as a as a thank you for the 500. Um man wow I just don't know what to think you guys are amazing back the dude painting the houses Tim Star hello I bought a house with my wife and we are slowly finishing I would like to ask you to paint the walls in it because we have come to the conclusion that everything in white is terribly boring it is also necessary to install the missing devices etc two air conditioners two radios. Hope that you will not take much time. We would like to move in soon. You're faithfully. Tim Starr. Well, Tim, let's get to it, Jinger. But, uh, <laughs> yeah, so, uh, again, thank you guys so, so much for 500. Uh, I know to a lot of people that is not very much at all. In fact, most people don't even bat an eye at it. But, for someone who thought never in a million years I would ever get to this point, I am excited about it, and oh, that goes right in the living room. Okay, sweet. What? Oh, so that was a closet for a minute. I was like, damn. Uh, that is a huge number for me, and I and I couldn't be more excited. You know, it's freaking amazing. Uh, you know what? We'll start in here. Oh, oh. alrighty. We got some new stuff, huh? Excuse me. <clears throat> but uh yeah that is my plan guys um i'm gonna do five oh okay well i didn't know we had to do that now uh there'll be five winners i gotta figure out a way to do a contest or what i'm even gonna do to get those winners um it'll be uh like i said a game of ten dollars or below of your choice i don't i don't care what game it is um yeah as a big thank you to you guys i like i said i couldn't do it without you <clears throat> i would never imagine in a million years i'd ever get to this point um so it's a huge deal you know like i said to a lot of people 500 is not a big deal but for someone like me it is uh, because you know this is more of a hobby for me you know i'm not here to make money i'm not i mean it would be nice but you know, I'm not here to make money. That's why I do have a job. Um, and the way YouTube's been going, you know, they're making it difficult for people whose goal is to make money on this, uh, you know, broadcast. And it's a shame, you know. It's, it's a real shame. You got people like Mr. Feather who bust his ass every day you know that he can to uh put out good content and uh good videos and you know he gets screwed he gets screwed quite a bit because of youtube it's it's a sucky deal and let's go with lime and i'm only saying let's go with lime because that's what they asked for Boo -doo, boo -doo. Um, but yeah 
So, anyways, what I plan is next now with the with the channel is, of course, obviously to hit 600. You know, I, I just my ultimate goal would be hit a thousand subscribers, but you know, I'm realistic. I try to take it take it one at a time. You know, I finally hit 500. Now my next goal is to get 600. Um, I, I I'm not sure. I've thought about maybe doing a Q&A for this 500 since it is kind of a milestone. I'm not sure. I don't know. I may wait to do that till I hit a thousand. I mean, I don't really know what people would ask me. It's kind of I kind of live a boring life, really. And uh, yeah. Nobody, nobody's really interested in the life of a of a city worker. And if they are, well, then you're probably on some drugs. You might want to get checked out. You might want to get yourself checked into uh, to rehab. But, uh, <clears throat> I don't know, that was kind of mean. That, that was really mean. I'm sorry. Not all drug addicts want to be city workers. Some of them want to be state workers. Some of them are state workers. Oh, did I say that out loud? I tarry mo dot. Oh, am I? But, uh, yeah. So, anyways, uh, you know, as you guys see, I've, I'm trying to do some random games on the channel. Uh, I've started, uh, this is the police. I don't know how you guys liking it. Um, it's not a game I actually thought it was. I, I thought it was more interactive. And it, it's not. It's more of a story base game which those aren't bad you know I'm not I'm not saying that's bad at all I'm just that's not the kind of game I'm used to playing but uh you know if you guys are interested I'll, I'll keep playing it um I was I, I still enjoy demolition to build 2018 but I clearly can see that <laughs> you guys are not fascinated with that game no more so I think that's going to come to an end now um but you guys still love House Flipper. You guys are still liking the PC building simulator. Um, I, I've had a lot of requests of Wreckfest. Um, I was kind of hoping that was going to be on the Steam sale, and it wasn't. So I wasn't able to get it this uh, this go around. And uh, I have to get it when I get my next paycheck. I couldn't get it with this one because, well. I am a father and I am an adult and unfortunately I have child support to pay and uh, that child support takes a big old whomper out of my check. Of course I'm not complaining about it, you know, it goes to my daughter and that's the important thing. But I wasn't able to get the game like I thought so I will end up getting Wreckfest like I said I've had a lot of people ask for it. Um, so hopefully not this week but next week I will get it. And start doing that. There's somebody I know that's already got it, jackass, <clears throat> and uh, and he's been bragging all about it. And that jackass is is Mr. Feather. He's been bragging about it. He's been hooked on it, which now makes me even want it even more. Uh, I don't know why we we me and him kind of have this same same taste in a lot of games. A lot of games we kind of get excited about. So, if he's saying it's a good game, I know I'm going to be hooked. I already know it. Did I get... Damn, I did... Damn, I am on fire. So, I am excited about that. Um, I do have... Uh, uh, oh, I can't remember the full name. It's fishing like Baron C or something like that. Oh, it's full. Okay. I do have that. Uh, I've done a couple episodes on it. And i have actually, not going to lie, I completely forgot all about it. So, uh, why do you have a light switch but no light? That makes a lot of sense. Oh, well, I'm not going to ask. They want... Peach. Alrighty. <clears throat> there we go. Um. So yeah, there's that. Uh, let's see. Let's see what else games. Um. I still got a few more episodes of L.A. Noir to finish. Uh. Oh. Oh. 
I don't know why that was taken off. Uh, there was one problem there, buddy. Bring that back up. Oh, you got air conditioning. Oh, okay. Um, anyways, as I was saying, I got LA Noir I'm going to finish up. Um, hopefully going to do that soon. I think there's only, I think we're getting pretty close to the end, so there should only be a few more episodes. Um, as soon as that's done, um, I think I'm going to do a Let's Play of Bully, which it's, it's an older game, but it's one of my favorite. It is one of my favorites by, uh. by Rockstar so we're gonna do a let's play with that I tried streaming it that didn't quite work out so well so after uh, LA Noir is done we'll do a gameplay of Bully because rumors has I don't know if it's true but rumors has it next year because you know they're coming out with Red Dead Redemption this year but uh, next year supposedly and it, it, this is just hearsay and if it's been confirmed or anything like that, and it probably won't be until uh, PAX East, I'm going to guess. But uh, supposedly the next Rockstar game will be Bullies 2, which I hope it is. That was a game I enjoyed a lot. It was, it was a fun game. So we'll do that. Then we still got uh, Mafia 2 to finish up. And when that's finished up, I am going to do, I, you know, I've live streamed Mafia 3 a couple times, but I've never actually done a full gameplay of it. So I'll do a gameplay of Mafia 3. Um, I, I, I love the Mafia series. It's, it's a very, very, very fun game. So we'll get that. Um, I still got to figure out mining. And tunneling simulator, uh, you know, I think it's a fun game. It's up to you guys. I don't. Know. You guys seem to like it. I don't know. If it is, just let me know. I'll keep that series going. Uh, what other games do I get? I got a lot of multiplayer games. I wish I could get. Probably do a few episodes of Soul Play of ATS. You know, <clears throat> probably do a few more car mechanics. I plan on getting. There's been a lot of DLCs updated on Car Mechanic Simulator, so I do plan on doing that and doing a few episodes of those. Um, as far as live streaming goes, um, as you guys seen yesterday, I I'm really hooked on this. Uh, well, it's not really a new game. It's a new game to me. I just recently purchased it. Um, we were looking for something to do for Keller Stream. Keller was like, ah, I don't want it. I don't want it, you filthy wanker. And I was like, well, that was very rude, Keller. But you're my good buddy, so I'm going to get it for you. So we purchased Rocket League because Phoenix already had it. I've been wanting to get it. Got it for Ty Ty, even though his little bitch ass don't ever want to play. And we knew Chief had it. And I think Brandon had it too. I can't remember if he had it or he just got it. But either way, he's got it now. So we played that a little bit for Keller Stream. Ended up falling in love with it. Even got Keller to fall in love with it. Which I knew he would. I, I know the kind of guy Keller is. He's a sports guy and he's a competitor guy like me. So I knew he was going to fall in love with it. And you're welcome, Keller. You are. You're very welcome. Um, but then we, I ended up live streaming it yesterday. Sunday, I live streamed after my daughter left and uh, got Chief to join in. Uh, you know, what can I say about Chief? He, he's a great kid, he's fun, and uh, I like it. We did learn one thing though uh, if, if it comes down to a big, big match, me and Chief are teammates. We uh, we rock it together, we we murder that game. Uh, Brandon joined in, poor, poor Brandon, he, he needs a lot of help. 
I mean, seriously, he needs a lot of help. Mentally, and just needs a lot of help. But, uh, yeah, we live streamed that for a little while. So, I, that is something I do plan on live streaming quite a bit. I, like I said, I enjoy the shit out of that game. Uh, never knew it'd be that addicting. But it is. Um, still plan on doing live stream of ATS every once in a while. Uh, still live streaming construction sim. You guys seem to love it a lot. Um, also, guys, on games like, you know, Rocket League or ATS or construction sim, if you got the game, you're more than welcome to join. More than welcome. You're more than welcome to come into Discord. You know, when I'm streaming, I'll always be in uh, Posse Hangout. So you guys are more than welcome to join in. Even if you don't got the game, you're more than welcome to come in and hang out. <clears throat> but if you got the game, you know, by all means, come in, hang out, join, join, and play. <laughs> you know, uh, thing about construction sim though is there is only up to four players allowed, so it's basically first come first serve. Uh, I had a problem with that the last time I streamed with multiplayer before my game got ruined and I had to restart was well, a lot of people were trying to come in unfortunately it is it's only four so it's first come first serve but uh, as far as games like ATS you know that's an open server you know you're more than welcome to come join we'll we'll let you know where we're at or where I'm at and we can meet up or some um, Rocket League I'm not exactly sure how many people I think it's six total I think it's three on three the most uh, so uh, you know if you got it you're more than welcome to join uh, it's it's a lot of fun. Let's see. Radiator. But uh, yeah. So got that over with. Uh, that that is the goal with the channel for now. Um, like I said, if you guys got any games that are coming out or anything major that you'd like to see, uh, see on the channel, just let me know. I will try to uh, get it. I can't make any promises. Um, you know, definitely let me know, and I'll I'll consider it. You know, if it's a good enough game or a good enough review, I'll definitely, if I can, I will try to get it. But anyways, let's move on to everybody else's channel. You know, uh, because besides just you guys, I wouldn't be where I'm at without my friends. Hey, pastel pink. What the fuck is that? We're about to see it. Oh, that's hey you. I'm painting Tyler's bedroom. Yep, this is Tyler's bedroom. This is some he'd pick. Uh, <laughs> uh, so you know, I want I do want to give a huge shout out to you know everybody else that's helped me along the way. Um, <clears throat> of course, as always. Mr. Phoenix Feather. Um, he, he's been a huge help. Been a great friend. Uh, yeah, I, I don't know what, what else to say. He, he, you know, great friend. A great streamer. Uh, great content creator. Uh, fun to joke around with. You know, we, we read off each other very, very well. Um, I really... You know, don't give big you know introduction to Phoenix because, let's be honest, uh, he's one of the main reasons I got most of my subscribers, and I'm not afraid to admit that. You know, I, I'm not saying I you know my goal was to go after his, people that are subscribed to him, but you know most of them come from his channel, and I have no shame in admitting that. Uh, I thank I thank him very much for it. Um, so yeah, you know, there's that. And then after him, you got uh, the always annoying pain in my ass, but I couldn't couldn't survive without him. My little buddy Ty Ty. You know, Ty, Tyler's just one of those kids that you always want to punch in the face, but then apologize for doing it. You know, he 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 will drive you up a wall. I mean, he really will. But at the same time, it wouldn't be the same without Tyler. Like, it would really not. You couldn't survive. You just couldn't. Uh, you know, you got you guys got to check him out. Make Send him some love. Um, 
he kind of really doesn't do much any other games anymore other than just 5M. So, you know, I know a lot of you guys are 5M fans. So, if you guys see Phoenix post a video and you want a different view on it, make sure you check out Ty Ty. Because uh, let's face it, he's goofy. There's always going to be something goofy on his side of it. So, I, I promise you, you will not be disappointed with Tyler's videos. Uh, it sucks that he doesn't do more videos. I kind of wish he would do more videos besides 5M, but that's basically all he does. Which, I ain't mad at him. I ain't mad at him for it. Um, then, after that, you got Mr. Dolty Dolt, a.k.a. The Sheriff, who, unfortunately, has been really, really busy here lately, so you guys probably haven't seen or heard much of him lately. Um, as you guys know, he, he's very, very involved in baseball. I think I think it's baseball. Baseball or softball? I know this is something to do with kids. I think it's, I want to say it is baseball. I could be wrong. It might be softball. Uh, but he's very involved with that, so he's been real busy lately. Um, but I'm sure, you know, when it starts cooling down or when the season's over, he'll be more active and get back to posting things on his channel. So, you know, just give give us some time. He's, he's a busy man with work and family and, and baseball. And then after that, you got the always freaking hilarious Mr. Keller. Um, yeah, I don't know what else to say about Keller because uh, you know if Keller's around, you're gonna laugh your ass off. I mean, it's, there's always gonna be entertainment. That's a guarantee. That's a guarantee. Um. I don't know if he's really posting videos. I think he's doing a lot of live streaming. He live streams every Thursday, guys. If you guys haven't figured that out yet, which I don't know why he wouldn't. Uh, he does stream every Thursday that he can. Here lately, he's been having a few computer problems. But he's slowly getting them fixed. You know, he is taking care of it. So, uh, you know, just give it some time. Uh, clean the window. Um, but he, he is, does stream on Thursdays. Uh, again, if you guys want some laughter, make sure you check him out. Because I will guarantee you will laugh your ass off. He always does. Um, then, after that, you got, as again, as I mentioned earlier, you got the newest member of the posse, Mr. Chief Romney. Uh, which, if you guys haven't... Uh, if you guys are involved in Farming Simulator, which most of you guys are, I do know that. Um, if you play Farming Sim or do anything with Farming Sim and you don't know who Chief Romney is, you seriously need to get yourself checked out. Like, you might want to put yourself in a hospital because I don't know how you would not have heard of Chief's name by now. I don't know if you guys seen the FS-901, which is back back with a brand new season of FS 911 um, if you guys haven't seen them fire trucks and how fucking amazing they look then yeah you're, you're definitely missing out because I tell you what you know here I am 30 years old chief is half my age I'm telling you right now that kid's got more talent with that computer on his fucking pinky than I do my entire fucking body I mean, you know. Oh, there we go. The the stuff that this kid makes is just absolutely amazing, and the detail that comes, you don't see that very often out of a out of a kid Romney's age. So I mean, it just shows you the talent he's got, and of course he's a great kid. I mean, he's he's a great kid. He's funny. Yeah, you know, I got I got to give him credit. He makes me laugh. He makes me laugh. And that's hard to do. I got a great sense of humor, but you know, usually kids Chief's age, I get annoyed with very easily. Uh, Chief was raised old-fashioned. I've noticed that. Uh, his parents should be very proud. And uh, yeah, I'm glad to have him around. He's a, he's a hellacious modder. Like I said, you know, the talent the kids got is just absolutely fucking amazing. 
And uh, if you haven't heard of them by now, then you're missing out on a lot. You are definitely missing out on a lot. Alright, so we need coca and sand almond. There's sand almond. Do that in there, and then it's coffee with milk. Coca. And it's, by the way, if you guys want to learn how to mod, I. Well, it's not really like a teaching thing, but, you know, if you guys want to see how Cheap makes his mods and stuff, make sure you check out his channel. Um, <coughs> he's always, well, I want to say always. He does a lot of live streams on how to make, or, you know, of him making his mods. So make sure you check them out. Uh, I've watched quite a few of them myself. They're very enjoyable. He's very enjoyable to watch. Uh, so, yeah, don't miss out. And like I said, if you if you really want to watch true raw talent, the kid's good. You know, I, I like I give credit where credit's due, and damn kid's pretty fucking good at what he does. And you know, he's not like most modders where if something's wrong and you tell him about it, he gets all mad. And that's one thing I, I completely respect Chief for. Um, is you know if some if somebody points out a problem, he fixes it. He doesn't boohoo, he doesn't nothing else. He fixes it and makes it a better mod. He's constantly working on them. And I have mad respect for that. Mad respect for that. But anyways, what I'm babbling on. Uh, so that's all the posse. Again, if you guys want to know their channel, check out the description below. Every single one of their channels is on there. As well as everybody that I know that has Twitch. Their Twitch channels is on there. Or most of them are. I, I haven't updated that for a while. <laughs> But after that, we got Miss Old Lady T Rex De Winter. Um, if you don't know who that is, uh, she is uh, making history right now. She is now considered the oldest living human being in the history of the world. No joke. No joke. Uh, if I remember right, you might have to ask her, but I think she's currently running at 132 million years old. It's either 132 or 133 million. One of the two, I can't remember. But yeah, uh, she's been around since dinosaurs. She really has. And for those of you who don't know, that is a joke. <laughs> that is a joke. Uh, people criticize me and Lady all the time because of the way we talk to each other. Guys, that, that's just how we talk. Uh, she's actually a very, very good friend of mine. Uh, I'm glad to have her as a friend. And, uh, if she didn't talk to me that way, I'd think she was mad at me. We give you shit... We know we talk shit on each other all the time. That's just how we do it. But make sure you check out her channel. Uh, she's done a lot of streaming lately. I think she's kind of gotten away from the recordings. I, I know she still does recording. I think of uh, of Ryzen. Uh, is that I could I, I can't remember these. She plays a lot of them survival games. I'm not very good at them, so I stay away. Uh, I know she does Stardew Valley. That I do know. She streams that quite a bit. And I think she posts quite a few videos of them. Um, God, I can't remember the other one. I want to say Ryzen or something like that. I could be wrong. And I think she does. I think she still does Seven Days to Die. But uh, yeah, there's that. And then of course, you can't not do one of these videos and not mention one of the sexiest beards of all time. Now this man that I'm about to mention. You know, I'm a guy. I'm a guy. And I'm not afraid of it. I'm not afraid to admit that this man has the sexiest fucking beard in the history of beards. Like, nobody could touch his beard. And if you guys haven't realized, I am talking about Silent Fan 85 Then you really need to go over to his channel. Not only check out the badass streams and content he's putting out, but you really need to go over and check out that amazing beard. It, it is sexy which is amazing because not only is he a great friend you know he's a, one of the greatest people you will ever meet uh, will do anything for anybody but he's 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 like the perfect guy he's got that and then he's got the beard 
You know, say what you want. I don't care. I don't care. Let's get this finished up. <sighs> and then you know what? As much shit as I give him, he's kind of an honorary member. I guess we give Brandon a shout out. If you guys haven't heard who Brandon is by now, we'll give him a shout out. We give him a lot of shit. But I don't know if he does YouTube. I think he I think he posts over on Twitch. I don't I do not have the link to his channel. I, I'm sorry. Um, but if you guys are in Discord, you know he's always in Discord. Be sure to ask him. I'm sure he'd be glad to give you a link to his his Twitch. So make sure you give that little dweeb uh, some help over there. Even though he's a pain in the fucking ass. Probably really don't deserve it, but we'll give it to him. And, uh, yeah, again, thank you guys very, very much for uh, 500 subscribers. I, I'm still kind of stuck in all right now. I, You know, I actually hit 500 a few days ago. But the way YouTube is going, I had a... I kind of wanted to wait a few days to make sure I actually hit it. Because they're real famous for saying like, oh yeah, you've hit it. And then the next day, be back down to like 490. Because they actually did that to me. I, I hit 500 and I think 1. And I was getting ready to make the video. And about that time, I refreshed my page. And I was down to 490, or no, 489. So I don't know what Willy Wonka's thing they got going on. but. <laughs> No, I didn't want to make myself look like an idiot. Like, hey, congratulations, I hit 500 subscribers. And you look over, it's like, no, dude, you only have 490. I've done that before. It's kind of embarrassing. Shazam, that one's done. Oh, they're all done. All right, hey, we're done. Just in time. Complete. But anyways, guys, that is going to do it for this video. Again, thank you, 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 thank you very much for 500 subscribers. You guys are absolutely fucking amazing. Um, if you guys like what you're seeing, make sure you hit the like button. If you do want to see more, hit the subscribe button. If you know, if you like what you're seeing, don't forget to tell a friend and say, hey, check this dude out. Check out his friends. Uh, you know, right now, uh, I would love to say, you know, you know, us promoting our videos is a good way of, you know, getting our name out there. It's really not. YouTube's kind of shitting on everybody right now. Uh, so if you really like, and I'm not saying it just for my channel, you know, if you like any of our channels or any other YouTuber out there. If you like their channel, the best way to help them out is word of mouth. Tell your friends, hey, you know, check out this channel. Uh, again, I'm not saying my channel. You know, if you don't like my channel, then you know, I, I wouldn't really expect you to <laughs> tell your friends. Um, but if there's a channel out there that you do enjoy, hey, you know, let a friend know. Say, hey, you guys might want to check this out because YouTube's not really doing that job for them anymore. So uh, again, if you like what you're seeing, make sure you hit the like button. If you want to see more, hit the subscribe button. If you want to know any time I post a video or go live with a live stream, make sure you hit the bell symbol next to my scrub button that I'm notified when I do either one. As well as going to my Facebook page, The Outcast Posse's Facebook page, and my Twitter, which the links to those are in the description below, as well as everybody's YouTube channel that I just mentioned, everybody's Twitch channel that I just mentioned. But until next time, guys, I'll talk to y'all later. Peace!